Hello, brothers and sisters of light and dark. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my eccentric down the rabbit hole crazy taxi page. I want you to talk about common sense. I also talk about many other things. I really want you guys to make it out there in, in reality, in life. I don't really want to see you guys having a harder time because um, um, you're broke or something. But this is a good strategy, which I saw on another channel and shout out to uh, CEG dealer school for showing me this tactic but as I said before every strategy is different there's always going to be some sort of small marginal loss which is going to be five up to ten percent if it goes over like five percent I usually try not to um, if my chances are higher than five percent I usually try not to go all the way or put too much down into any strategy but I want you guys to understand one thing here uh, follow my instructions here and and you will make it clear you will make it clear so as you can see here it says win session is uh, zero okay I haven't won anything um, the whole goal of this strategy is basically to um, have 500 coming in to a thousand okay um, but you, you'll see my strategy as I put it down here. The, the whole strategy is is to play two columns at 200 and one column at 100. Okay? But it's not really in the column. It's, it's one of the split areas. You lose. You bust on zero, double zero, and one through six, which is a very high percentage. But as you, I'm going to show you here, you can also blend in my strategy, which is the high probability uh, a roulette strategy you can also add in here but I think it's too high of a risk depending on the table and I, as in my best advice as I always say before do not play these gambling games online guys do not play because what they do they monitor you they record you and they can cut it off your martingale system which makes you start all over they should give you that money back because if you just they should basically have a system in place is that you selected Martingale system. If you select Martingale system, they should be able to give your money back, but they don't. Because I lost some money because they stopped my Martingale system after the, the second or third try, and then I knew I was going to get one, and they cut me off. But anyway, let's begin with this. Two columns for 200. As you can see here, I just uh, won, okay? We're going to try to get our double our money back. The whole goal is to double the money that you have. In the video, he explained, I think he said it was 2500 but nobody's really going to go to the, the casino with 2500 So, I say try this two times, okay? Come in with a 1000 Or even, best bet, okay, cut that in half. Your budget should be 1000 or even less than that if you just manage it. You know if you multiply and do the math, you have to think about the Martingale system in, in play here. And as I'm going to spin here, I'm trying to get I already won 100. I'm going to try to get four in a row. But we know we are going to lose. If, we, if, you can, if you can do this on your first try on five turns, cool. As you can see, we have majority of the board covered. Majority of the board from seven all the way through 34 is covered. Which is a good strategy. I was looking at it, and I, I tried this many times. But we are going to try to keep playing until we lose something so we can get an idea on how to get the money back we lost. Now, I think we just lost one. Now, when you lose, right, I recommend that you double up to get that money, that 500 you lost, right? So you double up. Now, if you you end up hitting those numbers again, you could be in a world full of hurt. All right? So, I, like I said, my Martingale system, my Martingale roulette system is a little different from this because, you know, um, you can see 5, 13, and 7, and even 23 are odd numbers. You can easily put up. Whenever you see, if you just look over here to the right here, and you play the probability, what is the probability of evens popping up? It's a very high probability, but we're not going to do that now here. All right? We're not going to do that now here. It is said that you just play the, double the Martingale system, and I'll stay there and try to get the 500. See, I'm in the negative 300 now here, right? going to try to lose again. So, we didn't lose. We're going to try to get that money back. We might go. When you win, however, you do not reset. I repeat, do not reset because you're trying your best. You can reset if you want and try it. You can go back down. 
okay but you want to get that money you just lost because a lot of people don't tend to think about the negative you are in the hole right now all right we didn't go over 500 yet all right so we're going to spend again i do not do not constantly double martingale because this is a high risk game see now we got zero now we're in the negative as you can see here we got zero 28 5 13 and 7 so if you think about it i will double up and see if i can get that money back that we lost okay if we hit there's a chance that you can lose four in a row but you may have to switch it up i recommend you just if you want to switch it up guys you can do that okay but I recommend that you get that win session above what it's supposed to be. Because I could be having a bad day. Okay. See, we're getting 400, 400 at a time. Okay. See, he's down to 300. And what I saw him do, he actually won nine in a row. Okay. Which is a pretty good thing. You can see I'm winning a lot. It seems okay. But there are bad days which you may have. Like for right now, I know I can get my money back. Okay. If you see down here, it's 100. I can easily put 1,000 on um evens and then double that up but i'm not going to do that here we're trying to get the money back we're trying to get above the amount that we're supposed to get and so we got a two now you see it's not my lucky day we lost two thousand and this is why i don't recommend this strategy all like that because unless you switch around and jump around okay you will most likely lose your money even if you martingale but look at my strategy here Look how my strategy covers up. I believe, and I know strongly, that I went to the casino many times. I lost twice, but I, I, can't, I went there for like one week and tested this theory out. And it worked. I only lost three times, but I won, you know, uh, six times. No, I won five, five times. It's seven days a week. I tried it, and I came, I only lost three. And I, got, I won four times. No, no, it's, it's two times. I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember. I repeat lost two times but i won five times all right all right so you already know that when you keep going to the casino you have to keep track of your numbers okay now as you can see here we have two 15 and seven okay so i'm just gonna roll i'm gonna change this to 1000 i you see it says the win session is negative but look at my strategy compared to if you if you can't win you should stop gambling okay now we see that we got three blacks here right also we can play two ways we can play 19 through 36 or we can play red okay so we are going to play 19 through 36 i'd rather play it that way because we already have numbers that's we're not playing every hand okay we're not playing every hand and as you as you can see we're going to double up see it's much more quicker too this double up you're not going to lose five in a row. You're going to get the money back that you lost, okay? We are focused on getting the money back that we lost. As soon as we get this money back, you'll understand that that number will change drastically much more quicker than the other way around. He was lucky to hit nine in a row, okay? But we're going to try to see if we can lose six in a row on my strategy. We're not going to lose six in a row, babies, okay? We're not going to lose six in a row. So we're going to play my system. We're still waiting till it hits 19 through 36. And sometimes you'll have a system that's rigged. So you got to be careful. I'm not going to lose a minion. So I'm just going to double up. And we got our money back. As you can see how fast the number went back down. Okay, look at the numbers. It's now it's a 900. Okay, we won, but we are also going to play. We have 24, 17, 17, and 3. We're going to play red. We're going to play red, guys. You can also play black and follow it. Go back and forth, zigzag. It's up to you. But red is going to be a high probability to play. As I said before, you could play zigzag, but you have to chop the chips down. Okay, we're, we're going to do Martin Gallows. It's very simple to do. Do not play every hand unless you see a pattern do not in my strategy do not see you see the red the blacks is playing a lot sometimes the system could be rigged it could be tracking you but we're just going to stick with my program and we're going to try to lose six in a row it's not going to happen okay but sometimes it can happen okay because the system is rigged 
So we got a lot of evens and odds here. Okay, let's go keep going and see how far. Come on, red, black. Sometimes you guys, you're going to lose, okay? And then you get the money back. Now, we already know what's going to pop up. We got the rig system, 36, 8, 2, 10, 24. What is the pattern? The pattern is going to be odds. All right? We're going to play odds. As a matter of fact, let's go to 2,000 because we know we get our money back much, much quicker. if We just bump it up because we know odds is going to be played. Now we see that a 7 is going to play as we are ahead now with my strategy. Now, the other strategy you can try to play that, but I do not recommend it because if you miss, okay, there is a chance. So I don't see a pattern. 7, 36, 8. There is no pattern there. So you do not play it. Already with my strategy, you're at positive. Okay? You might not be as lucky as he is when he played. I'm playing my strategy, which is called the 95% probability strategy you'll get your money see here's another strategy too if you see a lot of reds play play red you know and switch go back and forth nine times out of ten it's not it is going to be two in a row okay as you can see here sometimes the system will try to trick you and play around okay we're going to go black let's do the zigzag system martin gale system zigzag martin gale system zigzag as I said before, you can play it this way, but the problem is with this one is that you got to take the time to put all the chips down, and I won, okay, right? Now, we see that we have a 4, 22, and 12. We can play either odds. We can play either black, okay, you know, for the zigzag strategy, okay? So, which one would you prefer? My strategies, zigzag, probability, or... You can wait for the pattern, which is 4, 22, and 12, or odds, you know, you can play odds, okay? It's up to you. As you can see here, the win session is maxed out, okay, as we can see here. And, of course, we're going to have some situation where we're going to have the system kind of being rigged. Even the computer can read something and then just choose random numbers, like a green, which I had a feeling that was going to pop up. I knew that green. So let's watch my strategy, and then you call it a day, okay, right? You go there with enough money, so you can actually get some honey, okay, right? A lot of evens are being played for some reason. You can play the zigzags, or you can play my strategy, which I just said, okay? So a lot of reds are played. We ignore the, the greens. Please ignore the greens, people. Ignore the greens. So we're going to play red. We're going to play the zigzag method. We're going to follow the color that's being played. If it's red, play red. And if you miss, stay on red. You see how there's all these numbers that we can play? See how the trickery is with the computer? And let's rebet it. We're going to stay on red. We're going to do zigzag. We're just going to follow the colors, okay? Follow the colors, guys. No matter how many reds is played. Now, we know for a fact that black is definitely going to pop up. So instead of just staying on red, we are going to go on black. We know a green is going to pop up. It's going to be rigged if green pops up. Okay, so we're going to lose that. But we know that the Martingale system will save our asses because there's no such thing as 20 uh, reds ever going to pop up, including greens. Okay? As you can see here, it's a probability. Focus on probability, not possibility, peoples. We're going to go zigzagging again. We're going to... We're gonna do. The, we're gonna follow. We're gonna do the following. We're gonna do the zigzag, guys. Look at my numbers compared to. If you lose, uh, you sh you should quit gambling. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's not about that. Okay, we're gonna follow it. Follow it. We're gonna see if it's gonna do zigzag. We see how many times in a row something pops up. You know it's gonna happen. Okay, so we we think it's how, how many times you think it's gonna zigzag. Two thousand Martin Gale system. When you lose. You Martin go. You must get the money back. You must get the money back. Now I'm gonna end it here because you can see my patterns and strategy here. We got an eight, seventeen, one, and two, right? So obviously it's gonna be nineteen through thirty-six, right? I do not recommend to play that other game, but it seems like a good tactic you can use to add on to that strategy. And shout out to C E G. Dealing school. Sometimes I think they work for the casino. Casino. 
because some of their most of their games are actually flawed okay because I said hey you got to get the money back that you lost because you'll be in the hole <laughs> other than that you are very much welcome we're gonna try another one we're gonna go 2000 because we know we are sure that 19 to 36 is going to pop up because it's like roughly four in a row already see it's still going on the left side of the board Let's see we got one you got 12, 2, 1, 17, 8, and 9. 9, 8, 17. All of this means that there's a higher chance that what I'm saying is true. 19 through 36 is going to be played. Double it as high as you can, but don't go too high. Don't get greedy. Okay, because the system can get rigged. Like you see here, all these little one digits and stuff like that. It can happen. I don't go no higher than 32,000. Okay. Okay, because what's going to happen is that. I know the system is rigged if I lose that okay. Okay, this should be the game that you guys should be playing. If you lose then this roulette system, my roulette system, you shouldn't gamble at all. Alright, so 33, 3, and 9. It's odds. We are going to play even. Okay. The focus, if you just focus on uh, 1 through 18, 19 through 36, okay, you'll be better off, okay? You'll be better off to focus in on that, okay? Rebet and Martin Go system. Evens is bound to pop up. Just four odds. Okay? Follow the strategy. Look at my mouth. Now, if you just keep playing that strategy as I had played before, you, your chances, you can't, you still win. You know, but you might get lucky like him. He got nine in a row. And I was like, okay, that's just chance at that time. He could just go home. He had extra money. But other than that, you are very much welcome to play my system, the zigzag method, or the probability, zigzag probability method that I created, or you can play the regular probability method in which I created as well. Now, it's up to you. I'll put the link in the description. As I said before, shout out to CEG Dealer School for showing that st earlier strategy that I explained. And good luck. And if you most likely win, send me some money. Send me some money in my, my cash app down below on my PayPal. Guess what? Because I'm not your average man. I'm not your Peter Pan. <laughs> she liked to go in the closet. I told her she'll get special gifts if she's, if she's sitting in the dark. Okay. <laughs> she's in the closet on her phone. But anyway. Understand this. It's all about probability, not possibility. It's a wordplay, guys. If you know your chances are 95%, listen to the person. Okay, They're trying to help you. We're not all trying to do OnlyFans. Because I'm like the only guy that was ever on OnlyFans. <laughs> I'm trying to flex my Pornhub uh, business. But they took that shit down. Because okay? it was too unique for you guys to understand. But... Other than that, um, y'all have a nice day. I love you all, but I despise the many. Okay, you're, you're just too old, okay? <laughs> Not too old. You're too lames. You're too many lame people. Sometimes I get crabs in the bucket. Okay, they try to latch on. But, y'all have a nice day. Peace.